School is in. School is in. What, what you got for us today? Oh, are we on some, Will, some more Will Chamberlain? Yeah, or what? yeah, we're going to talk a little. Talk a little. Will, because there's so much stuff about Will that I actually forget. I had to write myself a little note or two because I, I was, all this stuff I know, but I can't remember to talk about it all at the same time. Yeah. And you know where now. We just going to jump into it. And, you know, people always talk about Will did this and couldn't do that. You know, one year, Will led the league in scoring, and, and they were pounding Will. They was telling Will, oh, all you is are just a big brute that can score and all this. So Will told them. He says, okay, well, I'll lead the league in assists next year. And the next year, Will led the league in assists. Not in assists per game, but in t- he was second in assists per game. Yeah. But at the end of the year, he had the most total assists. That's because he made his mind up to do because it. Because he told him he was going to do it, <laughs> and he averaged 8.7 assists, which was number two assists per game, but the other guy that was number one didn't play as many games. Hey, how often that. do you hear the you know, uh, somebody the compliment of somebody saying, what was a great passer? Yeah, nobody says that. Ever. Oh, he was just a big brute. He was taller than everybody. That's it. And we proved that to be a myth, too. False. <laughs> yeah, and then here's another <laughs> astounding statistic about Will. One year, Will averaged 48 minutes a game. So he played every minute of every game. Of every game. God. And then when you delve into it really deep, Will <laughs> averaged 48 Point some minutes because of overtime. Yeah, because they had four or five overtime games, <laughs> and he played, and he played, all played of that the too. overtime too. <laughs> so at the end of the year, we'll really average. For, I'm just gonna say four eight and a half minutes per game. Jimmy and Johnson would have loved Will, Will somebody, Chamberlain on the team. <laughs> that boy never get tired, yeah. man. Yeah, Will Will was so phenomenal, and uh, I got a clip. I sent it to to J A. and I don't know who this guy is, but he was he, he was confirming that. Will all time bench press was five hundred and fifty pounds. Yeah, and uh, and at age forty nine, Will was still bench pressing uh, four hundred and sixty five pounds. Okay. At what age? Forty nine. Is this on the? It's God. On the and, and 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 if anybody know anything about the bench press, the longer your arms are, the harder, the harder it, is. it is to bench press. If you want them short arm boys, it gotta go that's that far. Why, like that's don't even why count when that. you go on a football team. Some of the running backs are stronger than the offensive line. Yeah, because they got because short on. They got short on. They don't yeah. have. Now, can you imagine a Will Chamberlain? Oh. Seven foot one. Yeah. So long. He, so he's got to have at seven least, foot three inch wingspan. Something he's like got to have at least a 40, 40, 45 inch sleeve. Length. Yeah. Pushing that much weight. Because I got thirty six, thirty seven. I'm six two. Yeah. I got thirty. So I know Will got to be. And George Gervin had 41. We were all lower than him. Yeah. So I know we got a 40. And, and 460 pounds and 40. And 49 years and 49, old. 49, God. If anybody know anything Duh. about weightlifting, arm lifting, Woo. all that. That's amazing. Hey, Wilt was a beast of all beasts. Beast of all beasts. And then here's another fact. We That's gonna, crazy. We're going we gonna to switch over to track and field. Right yeah. Now. With Wilt? Yeah. Yeah. One year, it wasn't the big eight. It wasn't the big 12. Then it was the big seven. Yeah. Okay. One year. In the Big Seven Track and Field Championship, yeah, Will Chamberlain had more points by himself than the second place team. And we're talking about NCAA. In, no, in the in the in the Big Seven. Yeah, NCAA. It's NCAA though. Yeah, yeah, in, in college. Big Seven Conference. Yeah, yeah, big Big Seven. That's crazy. By himself, he had more points than the second place team. Wow, that dude. So what event? So I'm tripped out right now. So he I know I know he did the high jump. He he won the four hundred meters. Yeah. He won the long jump, the high jump, the triple jump, and the shot put. <laughs> what? And the, he's the, the, only, the shot put. And then he's the only and, and this is the thing. Will Chamberlain was undefeated in the shot put when he was in college. How do you win the shot put and the four hundred? No, how do you win the shot put and the high jump and the four hundred? Yeah. I've never seen a high jumper <laughs> run the four hundred. I've never seen a high jumper shot put. Shot put. I've never seen a four hundred. Now I have seen guys run the four hundred and high jump. Yeah, but I've never seen any one of those guys shut through the shot put. That don't make sense, man. So he was what? undefeated at the University of Kansas in the shot put. I won't even break that part up. But the, if you don't. All y'all got to do is just go check the facts. And then I was listening, and then Noonish fans, I I told y'all the film last week. That's insane, huh? I told y'all I'm the film out. about Will. What was that? Uh, I, I, I went up, and I found the track, and I sent it to you about the guy. 
He was on the competition committee. The rules and competition, he said, I, it was a recording. He said, I was at a game and I saw Will Chamberlain ducking from the free throw line. Yeah. So I went to the, to the rules and competition committee and told them that we can't have this. We we got to make a rule, so they made the rule where you had to stand at the free throw Somebody line. Somebody snitched on my little girl because he's hanging he do it. But little did he know, he didn't really have to worry about that because Will was going to be the only one to ever do it. Yeah, you know? man. But he that's, thought other guys were going to be able to do that's it. That's crazy. They, so they changed the rule. Yeah. That's, that's how that rule He didn't happened. realize that he was seeing something and, special. And, yeah. And this is, a, this is the part where I let y'all wrong. The guy said, you know, last week I told y'all he took two or three steps, right? Yeah. The guy said he took four or five. <laughs> okay, so I wasn't there, but the guy said he took four or five, four or five steps, and he ducked his free throw. So that goes back Will, to all that running from Will that, took four or five so, man, steps Will, and dunked Will his free is throw so attempts. Man. Unbelievable! As an athlete, he may not be the be the greatest basketball player. Yeah, and and let's get the Hall of Fame's that Will is in. Yeah, and when we say Will was in three Hall of Fame's. Yeah, he's actually in four. Yeah. Yeah, and we said it was the college volleyball. You said it, but it was professional. He's, a, he's professional volleyball, volleyball hall of fame. Volleyball, professional basketball, hall basketball, of fame. NCAA basketball, basketball, hall of fame. basketball. NCAA two A track and field track hall of fame. So we'll say he was in four different hall of fames as an athlete. Three sports, three different sports. That two like, professional, two amateur. Will Chamberlain, man, now, like I tell you. Know, He's been like the biggest misnomer in my life. Like, there's, I couldn't get information when I was growing up on him. We didn't have internet like yeah, this. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, and being able to see Wilt show. footage yeah. and hear these Wilt stories, like, yeah. I'm soaking and it. And all you gotta uh. do, these people are saying this. I didn't say it. I'm just repeating. And all this other stuff is documented. Man. Yeah. This stuff is documented. Wilt Chamberlain ran a 10 400. Will Chamberlain ran a 10 400. And then duck. went and won the shot put in the same track meet. That, like, this, that, that don't make sense, man. You know, so, that don't make sense. So, you know. Go do your research a, on Wilt, man. And we all, we and, all have and, these and gold I, conversations. And then now go I'm do your research on in, Wilt. I'm going to throw this in here. Know these fans. I'm going to start on this. A lot of people don't, didn't know this. You know, Bill Russell was a track and field athlete also. No, I, I didn't know that. I didn't know that until right this second. <laughs> yeah, Bill Russell is a track and field athlete. Okay, also. so what what Bill Russell do? Was he a shot put guy? I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna, nah, nah, nah. He, he wasn't near where the wilt was, but he did high jump 10 feet. I mean, I mean, no, 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 6 feet 10. 6 feet 10. Ooh, yeah. Please take that out. Not, not 10 feet. Who was about to say? That's a, that's 6 a, feet 10 inches. That's a universe record no, right there. No, that's no. my alien on them, <laughs> yeah, on them yeah. high jump. 6 feet 10 <laughs> inches, not 10 feet. <laughs> You know, I get a little excited when I talk about these old guys because they did so much. Yeah. But, but Bill Russell, and then we'll dive into some of the stuff he did later because we're yeah. going to ring the bell on, on Bill we're Russell. We're going to ring the bell another and, and, week and, and, on and, and, Bill Russell. And, and, and let me just say this, too, while we're on this little school school deal right here. Yeah. You know, they uh, in the in the history books, Akeem Olajuwon is the all-time shot blocker in the, in the NBA history, right? Mm. That's because they weren't recording blocks back in the exactly. day. Exactly. That's what I was going to let the fans know. Yeah. But <laughs> Will Chamberlain and Bill Russell both was retired when they even started counting shots. Wow. Shot That's crazy. So there's no way in the world that I can't Akeem Olajuwon Olajuwon one. block more shots than two high jumpers. Yeah. 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 And so that's got to be. They, I they mean, should they put can't an go back and try to figure out now. But I'm sure they got something there, yeah. like the 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 block shot was not recorded until. Oh, okay. they, yeah, they got, they got that, they but they don't have all of Will Chamberlain and uh, Bill Russell block. Yeah, so, that's crazy. So they can't, so they can't add them all. Because I know Bill, man, I Bill know Russell Will and Will Chamberlain block more shots than Hakeem Olajuwon. But it wasn't an official stat to 1973. How, how many how many blocks you think Will averaged the game? If just off the top of your head, four five easy. Yeah, four easy. five easy. That's crazy. You four have, five easy. Did, did he ever have a ten block game? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Ten block game. Several times, you think? Yeah. And this the whole thing. Even when yeah, block shots wasn't, Will had a triple double with twenty, twenty, and twenty. Twenty two points, twenty five rebounds, and twenty one assists. Yeah, I think Carl uh, Anthony Towns, I think, did that a few years ago, well, and everybody 20, 20, made, 20. they tripped all the way out. It was, it was a few assists though. No, it wasn't 20 assists. I mean, yeah, and and, 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 uh, and a couple of guys that had a quadruple 
double, you know, points, rebounds, and 10. Yeah. I think Wambi just did it. Uh, I don't think it was 2020. I think it was 10, 10, 10. No, no, I, I mean, okay. yeah. It was a, yeah. But, but he had 10 blocks. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, he had 10 blocks with it. So I know when Will had that triple double, he probably had 10 blocks. Man. So it probably was a quadruple double. Yeah, man. You know? That's so, crazy. So these, these guys, these old school guys, and all I hear, especially in the NBA, is all these podcast guys, all they do is they don't realize they they run in their own game. Yeah. Because all they do is talk about what the guys before them couldn't do. Yeah. So if those guys couldn't do much, that means y'all not doing much because yeah. you have to come from somewhere. Yeah, for sure. For you sure. know, and, and and this is the whole thing while we on basketball. We, hey, we're here to bring some straightening to the facts, man, yeah. on the history and, on the and, historical and this is the tip. thing. When you hear um I hear all these guys say, oh, Oscar Robinson couldn't play but, uh, now. Bill Russell couldn't play now. And it's never Michael Jordan, Larry Bird. It's not even Steph or LeBron. No, they go, they go it's back. A, it's always J.J. Redick and, and, and Jason Williams and, yeah. and uh, 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 what's this, Jeff T. And all, all these middle of the road guys are always talking about who could. But you never hear the great ones poo-pooing on the other great hey, ones. Hey, 20 years from now, Jordan ain't going to be nothing. Yeah, exactly. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Larry Bird and Manny Johnson, they're going to be They're already fading. They're you know already, what I'm saying? Like, already, that's I, that's, I that's how it goes. Jeff, so. I just heard Gilbert Arenas and Jeff Teague, them talking about how bad they played in the 80s and 90s. Yeah. They came, they couldn't play them like And that's crazy to me. I just So I just met Gil, Gil, Gilbert Arenas when the big three was here. Yeah. Met him and Dr. J at the same time. Yeah. and uh, Gilbert yeah. said all this stuff. Yeah. But when Dr. J and, and uh, Rick Mahorn was right there. Yeah. He didn't say all that. He wasn't saying all that, and yeah. if he did say something, they was they was quick to check him. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Remember, that's when that's when I said that the the Wimby and Ralph Sampson compa- yeah. comparison that you yeah. brought up and, and, and Dr. J was ex- that, exceptional, bro. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. They agreed with it. You know what I'm saying? Like, there's nothing new under, under the, the sun. sun. It's just, just a matter it. of how far your resources extend. And I just heard Kenny Smith say something. I think this was just yesterday or day before yesterday. Somebody asked him, he said, uh, somebody asked him, said, Steph and Kyrie, the best handlers you ever seen. He said, no. Oh, no. He exactly. said, no. And he said, why? He said, man, there's so many people had that. He said, but back in the day, you would get put on the bench, you would get criticized, yeah. and you would get cut from the team for doing what they do. I got to correct you. He said, he said, we all had that in yeah, our bags. Yeah, we all had that. And, and, in and, our bags. And, but and we couldn't do it in remember, the game. Guys right here in Dallas, man, they could do all of that and shoot from <laughs> shoot from so far out. And uh, yeah. they went out for the high school team. can do nothing with it. The coach wouldn't let them play because the coach said, oh, you two playground. Yeah. But then every time he caught the guys that the coach had starting up to the recreation center, it came to business. Yeah. But – you know, the coach wouldn't start. Absolutely. You yeah, it's, it's you different style of play. You go behind your back too much. You go between your legs too much. You you wiggle too much. You shoot too far out, you know. Different style of play, yeah, man. Yeah, so, so sports different have game. changed so much. Big time. Big time. Big time. But we're going to keep this thing rocking, man. What we get?